This video is brought to you by Bespoke Post. The new TV ratings are in for Cartoon Eric and Nickelodeon. It's not looking good. We've already known for a long time that cable TV is on the decline. Still, it's not often we get a sense of the actual numbers to go along with that. That's why it's interesting to hear about the recent report from Muffet Nathanson. They released a ton of information about live TV viewers from 2019 to 2021. Indie Wire goes into detail about the highlights of this report. In terms of individual ratings losers during the COVID-19 pandemic, Cartoon Network was the hardest hit with a 34% drop. Nickelodeon also got hammered with a 23% decline. IndieWire reached out to representatives for Cartoon Arc for the story, but we did not immediately receive a response. One Nickelodeon source, who spoke with IndieWire for the story, on the condition of anonymity, pointed to a slew of their Paramount Plus originals hitting number one overall on the subscription video on demand service as evidence of the group's all-in streaming push. The number ones include Cam Coral SpongeBob's Under Years, The Paw Patrol Movie, and Star Trek Prodigy. This report goes on to mention that ratings all around are rapidly decreasing, and it's not limited to just Cartoon Network or Nickelodeon. This paints a terrifying picture for the future of cable. But before we get to that, today's video is sponsored by Beastbug Post, their monthly membership club delivering awesome boxes of top shelf goods from underrated brands. They actually buy 90% of products from small businesses based right here in the US. You can browse a selection of boxes and choose whatever you want, even being able to preview the box before it's shipped. You can specify your preferences and make changes. These boxes have a retail value of $70, but you'll be paying a fraction of that value. For me, I decided to go with Beam, which includes this really nice headlamp for dark places. It's convenient and high quality. Weekender has this sturdy bag that carries all your necessities on the go. Retreat has a hammock I can just chill with. It helps you relax outside. I'm not complaining. It's actually kind of comfy. Now, if you're interested in buying some cool stuff, there's actually a discount for you. To get 20% off your first box, click Click the link in the description and enter Veil20 at checkout or go to bespokepost.com slash Veil20. Let's do this. Okay, so when we're talking linear TV, animation is in trouble. People are tuning in more to news or sports, which is pretty much what's dominating cable. But with these big cartoon channels losing tons of viewers, we have to ask, what does that mean for the future of their content? Is it in danger? Well, kind of. When it comes to cable, they're fading away. No doubt about that. The pattern will continue, and maybe the channels will shut down in a few years if there's no reason keeping them up. However, the actual content being produced isn't going anywhere. It's only the method of consuming the content that's changing. Back on Paramount Mountain, where entertainment lives. Look, amigos, cave paintings of all who live here. This is the natural course of entertainment, so I'm not surprised at all. What makes me kinda sad though, is how we'll be seeing a lot less of those fun bumpers and commercials. Yeah, streaming is more convenient than anything else, but most of the time, it also misses personality that the channels have. That's what I'm especially gonna miss in the new era, and I don't know if they'll ever return in the same way. But at the end of the day, the report reveals that this drop in ratings is worse than we thought. Eventually, both of these channels will make a full migration to streaming. If you don't have Paramount Plus or HBO Max right now, you may want to get it soon. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and come up below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.